I think the big, one of the big changes is uh, affordability. Uh, if you look at the, the vehicle costs are going up, the fuel costs are going up. So what consumers are looking at is how can they get a lot more affordable uh, alternative for existing solutions. Uh, so I think that is one big change compared to what happened from pre-COVID to now. Um, and the other thing is definitely uh, sustainability as well. As we have seen, uh, as the EVs have becoming the, uh, becoming the norm these days, there are more and more OEMs coming and developing uh, e uh, e vehicles, which also can lead to the affordability again uh, because the petrol cost can be saved. Uh, so I think these are the two trends that we are seeing in Gentle. Uh, but if you look at our, because of pandemic, what also happened is a lot of people have lost their jobs. So a lot of people are looking at alternative ways to make money. Uh, uh, so to look at our, our drivers on a platform, one of the things that we do is, one of the things that we offer is a lot of actually students work with us uh, and make extra money by working for three hours. So I think for avoiding an alternative source of income uh, for an, for an I mean, as test to the role in the test and actually improve the lifestyle. So that is one thing that we have seen that organically there are a lot of people who are coming in to see that what to make extra money with the kind of platform that we have built. See, the only reason why the surge comes in and cancellation curves, so 15 comes in is because once the supply is limited uh, or if there is a constraint for people to work, have buy a new vehicle and then come and work with you as a, as a driver, and then it has an inherent challenges on creating supply. But it will be known well, because it is a meter that's sitting in the uh, The number of wheelers that already on the ground are born at 400 million. So we believe there's not only people who have vehicles and who are willing to work on these platforms. Mm -hmm. uh, it is the platform that you need to create to make sure that this becomes a lot more faster. So I think uh, a lot of these problems can be solved by making this onboarding Lot more faster without bringing the people who are sitting idle with, without having jobs or who are underemployed to get onto these platforms. So I think we believe, at least uh, from a two wheeler side, it is the challenges are uh, it is very different from compared to a four wheeler industry or a three wheeler industry um, uh, because there are enough supply on the day on the ground. It's just that you need to make sure that there isn't enough awareness about this as a concept uh, than willingness to work. Yeah, um, so if you look at uh, Apple journey last one year, we also expanded our services from just being a by taxi to uh, the three wheeler ride sharing and also on logistics uh, uh, quality course. Uh, and one thing that we are also, uh, we are present in more than 100 cities throughout the country uh, and we execute more than a million bytes every day. Uh, so it is, it is a beyond a metro phenomenon as well if you look at our distribution. 35% of our business also come from tier 2, tier 3, which is unique compared to any other ride sharing plan. So I think that is one of the things where we are actually proud of that we are actually creating employment also in smaller cities and also adds to it. So definitely uh, to make it even more affordable. Uh, so how can you make the existing uh, existing solution at even more affordable price? So obviously EV is one of the solutions to that. So the, if you can transition your fee from ICE to EV, uh, like the cost will be reduced at least by two rupees per kilometer, so which is almost twenty percent, which can be a lot more affordable either for the customer or additional loading for our drivers. Yeah. So that is one of the big transition. Another thing is about the penetration. So right now, uh, uh, the kind of penetration that we have in maybe a northern markets and western markets is what less than compared to a southern southern markets. And so it's about improving penetration a lot now. Penetration is more meaning about like, educating about the market than about the new city. So it's about we want to educate the market about the bike tax here piece here, and make sure a lot and lot people about every year and will start using it on their habits. For more updates from CXO TV, please like and subscribe to our channel.